the separation of state and church really affects so many different issues that I think people don't realize. Can you give uh, us like, some examples? Yes, I mean, you know, the, the, what the, the primary driver of uh, violating LGBT rights is conservative religion. Um, you know, you mentioned the Masterpiece Cake Shop case. You know, the first of all, that case is all about religion and using religion to exempt yourself from civil rights laws. Which, In the United States, we have civil rights laws, and those laws arose out of the the racial segregation and intimidation and discrimination um, that minorities had faced in the United States in the past. And so you had a gay couple go into this bakery. When was and this? They, this, was a, this was quite a few years ago now. And they said, we would like you to bake us a cake for our wedding. And before there was even a chance to discuss what the cake would look like, you know, would it be white? Would it say we're gay? You know, what would be on it? The uh, owner of the bakery said, nope, I don't serve gay weddings. I don't serve gay couples, so I'm not going to make you a cake. And so the state civil rights division said, you broke the law. Right. And the baker said, you know what? I have a free speech right, free speech right to not make this cake. And I have a religious right to not make this cake for these people. Mm -hmm. um, so, so those were the two questions that went all the way up to the Supreme Court. Uh, and the Supreme Court punted. <laughs> and it actually, it didn't decide either of those, those questions. Secular Jihadists is an increasingly influential podcast with much of its growing audience in Muslim majority countries advocating for atheists, secularists, and enlightenment thinkers. We want to reach out to more people. If we reach 500 patrons, we will be able to translate our shows into Arabic, Urdu, Persian, Bengali, Malay, Turkish, and other languages in these countries. Help us get there at patreon.com slash sjme.